Welcome to Ambri Insights. On the 4th of March, around 4,000 inmates escaped following gang-led attacks on two major prisons at Port-au-Prince, Haiti. Around 10 individuals died in the accompanying unrest across Haiti, and over 15,000 people were forced to flee their homes as a result of the ongoing gang violence. Following the escalation of incidents, including attacks targeting the maritime port, the airport, and police stations, the government declared a state of emergency in the Port-au-Prince region until 3rd April. Gang leader Jimmy Cherizier had also threatened the government with civil war and genocide unless the Haitian Prime Minister Ariel Henry resigned, which he did on the 12th of March. Amber assesses that Haitian gangs hold advantage in the deteriorating security situation of the country. Past data also suggests gang recruitment increases during periods of unrest, displacement and hunger. And due to the uncertain timeline of Kenyan police deployment, as well as the strategic issues with urban warfare against plainclothes soldiers, gang control over key areas such as Porto Prince is unlikely to be addressed in the short to medium term, and there is a serious threat of further gang violence until the appointment of interim prime minister is completed. For full analysis and implications, please follow the download link on our Insights Hub.